was Mother Tongue by Low Life off of their 1986 album Permanent Sleep. I've never heard of Low Life before. Uh, it was a pretty cool song. I really like that. Uh, like cool bass riff. The whole jam was really good. Uh, good vocals, lyrics. That was some good post punk slash goth rock. We're listening to that today because we have a song from the Smiths from 1986 up in competition today. In fact, we've got the same two albums matching up as we had yesterday today. Hi, my name is Bean and you're watching Battle of the Band. We're on day 150 of the Smiths tournament today, and that is match match 9 in round 3. If you're new here and you're wondering what the Smiths tournament is, let me explain. We took every single song that the Smiths released and we threw them into a single elimination style tournament. Now they're doing battle and head-to-head -head competition until one remains in the end. That's the very best Smith. And that's the very best song that the Smiths released. We're going to be starting off today with the title track from The Queen is Dead. The Queen is Dead. Released in 1986 on The Queen is Dead. Uh, it's a pretty long song, so we'll make this intro kind of short. Last round it defeated I Started Something I Couldn't Finish. And in round one it defeated Ask. Its competition today is... You've Got Everything Now, which was released in 1984 on their self-titled album, The Smiths. Last round, You've Got Everything Now defeated Hand in Glove, and it got a buy through the first round. So we've only listened to that one once on the channel. We've listened to The Queen is Dead twice. We should just go ahead and get into it and see which one's better. Here is The Queen is Dead.
that whole two minute segment at the end that's uh just the instrumental portion maybe gets a little bit uh overindulgent but i really love it it's so solid all the instrumentation on that song is really radical um cool vocals it's gonna be a tough one to beat let's see if you've got everything now has what it takes So You've Got Everything Now is a really cool song, too. I really dig the falsettos in there. Um, this one's actually really tough. Like, You've Got Everything Now isn't too long. It's just barely on that edge. Like, if they went on for another two minutes, it probably wouldn't be that great. The music would be fine, but it probably wouldn't be that great overall. The Queen is Dead has a really solid instrumental portion. I guess You've Got Everything Now did, too. 
But I do love how the Queen is Dead feels like a nonstop attack. And it's seven minutes long almost. Well, six and a half. And it's just like the bass is just driving through the whole thing. Um, and everything feels really frantic and immediate, very urgent. So I think I would go with The Queen is Dead. Um, overall, I think the vibe of that song is just a lot more uh, intense, and it's a bit better for me anyway. Like, You've Got Everything Now is a really cool song. Love the falsettos in there. Love the instrumental on there. But uh, just The Queen is Dead feels a little bit more epic, I guess in a good way. Like this video if you like the video, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Share it with anyone you know who might be into this kind of content, and let me know down in the comments which of these two songs you would have chosen if it were you in the hot seat today. That's all the Smiths tournament action we've got going for the day, but please join me tomorrow when we get down with some more of the Smiths and the Magnetic Fields Part 2 tournament action. Until then, I hope you all have a great night, fantastic afternoon, and a wonderful morning. Thanks for watching. Bye.